Now the big story today will be how Jose Soriano performs in his first major league start. The hard throwing Soriano comes out of the bullpen to do what he has hoped to do throughout his entire career. First pitch it's bounced by the mound and just out of the reach of the diving Angels second baseman that's Renjifo that's going to roll on out to Trout first pitch single for Yandy Diaz. Ground ball, it hits Soriano in the foot, and that's going to be an infield single. That ball, if it gets by him, which we were hoping for, that's an easy double play ball. Now, Renifo is right behind the pitcher, and just an unfortunate bounce there for the Angels. And Jose Soriano shrugs off the medical attention. This is an opportunity that he's waited a long time for. There's one that's off the glove of Soriano, and this one rolls too far away for Soriano to be able to handle it. So it's another infield hit. And some bad luck early here for the Angels as Tampa Bay has loaded the bases with nobody out. In the dirt gets behind Theis. He still can't find it. Here comes another man around third. A Rosarena will score. Going to third is Palacios. Two runs, two bases on a wild pitch to make it two to nothing. What a nightmare beginning here for the Angels. With still nobody out, the infield drawn in and the 2-2 pitch to Paredes is lifted in the air to straightaway center field. Waiting for a Joe Adele. Comes in to make the catch, tagging a third Palacios. And the Rays get them all home. Base is loaded, nobody out, and three runs are in. It's 3 0 Rays. Popped up, first base side. Drury on the dirt, way across from the bag at first, about halfway to second, makes the catch on that one, and that will be the second out. Soriano, a pretty quick worker, delivers, and that is right down the heart of the plate. A curveball struck him out looking. The inning is over, but first inning damage. We're headed to the bottom of the first. It's 3 0 Tampa Bay. Zach Littell making his third start of the season, giving up one earned run in 11 innings. The whip outstanding, very efficient, very effective, and he works quickly. And a pitch, a strike three, called over the inside corner. Renjifo punched out after he flipped the bat away. Littell gets his first K of the afternoon. 3-2 pitch to Moniak from Littell. Here it is. That's low. Ball four. And that's going to be ball four. So after the strikeout, back-to-back -back walks. Here is the big pitch, 3-2, and it's upstairs. He has walked the bases loaded. But well, we've never seen this. And Littell trying to figure out what is going on. He is ahead, though, at one and two. Here he comes. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. Two down. That's the split. And, and that was absolutely filthy. And you could see how that ball just falling down and in, falling down and in, and gets to know right over the top of it. What a great sequence put together there by Littell. Here he comes. Swing and a miss. He struck him out. It was not pretty. He walked three, but he also struck out three. And now at the end of one in Anaheim, it's raised three, Angels nothing. Jose Caballero leads it off here in the second inning. Caballero has been hot. Swings and hits one high and deep to left. Ward will go to the track and watch it sail away. That baby is gone. Jose Caballero with his first home run as a Ray, and it's 4 nothing in the second. And that ball was absolutely blistered, a no-doubter. The smack, the sound off the bat there was loud and bassy. Here's another 3-2 pitch, and that's a wave and a miss. Got him on a curveball, struck him out. Second strikeout for Soriano. First out in the inning, and Rort Vet will be the next batter. Here's a swing and a line drive hit hard, sinking into right, coming on, sliding, and not making the catch is Moniak. An instant call by Chad Witchin, and it's a hit for Rort Vet. Swing and a miss on the high fastball. A pair of strikeouts in the inning. Matthijs delivers one, a base hit to center. First hit for the Angels, a solid single for Theis. And a fly ball, short center, coming in in a hurry. Siri, he gets there and makes the catch. Jose Siri taking care of that one in shallow center field. First batter up here for the Rays. We start inning number three. It's another strikeout in this ball game. the fifth in the game for Soriano. Swing and a miss there. Well, Soriano has found his curveball. Back-to-back strikeouts to start the inning. We'll hit to the bottom of the third inning. The pitch. Swing and a miss. There's a good live fastball. And down on strikes goes Moniak for out number one here in the third. Fourth in the ball game for Littell. Here's Mike Trout, who has a walk his only time up. Trout goes the other way. Loops one toward the right field line. Long run. Palacios. He was able to cut it off as Trout digs for second base. Dives in with a double. Well, Mike Trout gets his fastball in that outer half. Just hits it off the end of the bat down on that right field side. Palacios, the right fielder, he was all in on this ball. He went hard. Well, Palacios doesn't cut that off. It's a triple at least. Yeah. 
Swing and a ground ball wrapped toward the hole. It's short. Diving stop by Caballero. Gets up, spins, throws. Got him. What a terrific play by Caballero to his left. Almost behind second throughout Sano. And that will end the third for Zach Littell in the Rays. Six, seven, and eight hitters for the Rays. They lead it 4 nothing here in the fourth. It's a one-hop shot. Oh, Handled play. by Renjifo with a backhand for the out. That's an incredible play by Renjifo. It's a rocket his way, a tough hop. Stay with it. Gathers himself. Good throw the first base. That's on the outside corner, strike three. As Soriano freezes Caballero on a new career high with his sixth strikeout. Two up, two down. Jose Siri. He'll drop this one into right center and get extra bases. To the wall it goes, and Siri on his way to second with a stand-up double. Two base hit number four on the year for Siri. Lefty batter goes after that one and lifts the ball high in the air down the left field side. He'll make the catch and that'll end the inning. So the last couple of innings have been good for Soriano. We're headed to the bottom of the fourth. Two out, nobody on base. And Matt Tice, who singled to center his first time up, will step in. Matt Tice has hit the ball hard twice. This time, Siri cannot make the play as he knocked it down, and that was all. Tice ends up at second. It's a two-out double. So here's Neto. Bloops one toward left field. This one dropping. That's a base hit. Dice heads home. A Rosarena's throw to the plate. Not in time. Neto takes second after an RBI to get the Angels on the board. Two well-placed baseballs result in a run. Making some contact. One ball, no strikes. Renifo at the plate. And a ground ball. Oh, what a stop right there. And the long throw, and what a pick at first by Yandy Diaz. Caballero making the stop at short, and Diaz making that pick up at first. Put a couple stars on each one of those plays. And now we go to the bottom of the sixth. Raise four, Angels one. Joe Adele at the plate for the Angels. Here's the pitch on Adele. This is hit well out into right center field. It's out by the wall, and that ball is out of here. Joe Adele, his first home run of the season, and the Angels get a little bit closer. It's a 4-2 Tampa Bay lead. That is the perfect swing and you want to see from Joe Adele. Yes, he could pull the baseball, but to stay on that one and go the other way, blast the right center field. Well, Adele is enormously strong. He's going to wear the halo. Bottom of the eighth. Let's see what the Angels can do as we head there. It's 4-2 Rays. Here's Adele. Lines this one to left field. A base hit. The tying run will come to the plate. Matt Dice will be the batter. Runner takes off. The pitch is down. The throw's not going to be a oh. touch. Oh, but he overran the bag and he's tagged out. Wow. How about that for a big, big mistake by Adele? He overran the bag and was tagged out. He was safe. Well, the Rays will take a two run lead into the bottom of the ninth inning. And Pete Fairbanks enters the game. 3 2 pitch. Strike three called a pitch that did not look like it had the plate and Ron Washington's upset called it all day long and that's not a strike the two strike pitch swing and a miss he struck him out and the Rays are an out away three pitch strangulation there of Zach Neto by Pete Fairbanks and the Rays are one out away from a winning series and a winning road trip one out to get here is Luis Renjifo. Time run will come to the plate. We'll see if Moniak can give Trout a swing here in the bottom of the nine. And Doug Eddings really helping out Fairbanks with those high strikes and those wide strikes. And yeah, Ron Washington's letting him know right now. First time we've really seen Ron Washington aggravated with an umpire. Moniak strikes out. Now Ron Washington. Yeah, he should do that. And Ron Washington. Wants to have a word with Eddings, but he walks off the field. And the Rays win this one. It's a 4-2 to two final.